Yo, what's up, YouTube? My name is Chishu Zed. Back in here with another video for you. Peace, positivity, self-awareness, and motivation. Guys, so real quick, do me a favor, hit that like button. As always, man, I appreciate you guys when you do that. Um, recently saw a photo from The Shade Room shared on Instagram. Add me on Instagram, Chishu Zed. And I saw a picture of Drake and Kanye and immediately I thought, is this happening? Are they finally squashing their beef of many, many years, right? So unless you've been living under a rock or don't listen to hip hop at all, Kanye and Drake have been beefing now for a while, man. And to my surprise and very unexpected, they finally squashed that beef. As you guys know from previous videos, I'm a huge fan of Drake and I'm also a huge fan of Ye. So it was great for me to see this and it got me thinking, it's important for men to learn to put their emotions aside and come together for the sake of a common goal, right? Oftentimes in life, people fall out and even forget what it is that they're fighting over. You know, we see this all over. Recently, we've seen rapper after rapper after rapper get taken off the face of the planet, right? Just based on some beef, based on two people who disagree, emotions that never got settled. And guys, while I understand that like people are gonna beef, right? Men will go to war. Men will have disagreements. I also do understand that in most cases, things can be avoided when they could really just be hashed out. I truly believe if you don't have the type of temperament to squash beef, settle situations and not let them eat you up emotionally, before they blow up into something that you cannot contain, then you cannot reach a certain level of success in your life, right? This applies to everybody, not just celebrities, man. There are a lot of men out here who are hurting, right? Who haven't forgiven people for things that they've done in their past. And to that I say, you've got to let go of those things that are weighing you down. You got to make peace with your past because you think it's hurting the other person, but it's truly hurting you you from moving forward, you from truly being happy, you from going out and reaching your true potential, right? So just wanna encourage you guys, this is a short video, this is not something I'm gonna go real deep into because I'll be honest with you, I don't care at the end of the day, right? I don't care what Drake and Kanye are beefing about, but as a metaphor, I think what they did is powerful to what other men can do in their lives, right? We hold things against other people, we may hold things against even ourselves. You got to learn to forgive other people. You got to learn to forgive yourself. And what's next for them? I wouldn't be surprised if they're working on a Drake and Ye album, right? That could be historical at the end of the day. If you're fans of both these artists, that would be crazy. They would make a lot of money from that working together, two goats, right? Two greats who come together, and make some good music. Regardless of what you may think of these guys personally, they're talented musicians, right? And holding that type of resentment towards somebody else never leads to anything if it's not sorted out or worked out within you. So I encourage you, man, if you're holding anger, if you're holding resentment, if you're holding unforgiveness um, towards anybody in your life, it's not hurting them, it's hurting you, right? Work those things out. Feelings of hate that are kept inside often lead to disease, often lead to mental illness. Let go. Forgive doesn't mean you have to go back necessarily to that same relationship and trust that person like the way you used to. No, it's, just, it's not what that means. But it means that you've let it go and you're not there and you're not there angry and holding on to that pain. But as far as artists go, I really am curious to know what you guys think of their music, right? I'm talking about Drake and Ye right now, man. Let me know. Are you a Drake fan? Ye fan? Let me know down below. I appreciate you guys for checking out this video. My name is Chisha Zed. Until next time, hit that like button. I'm out. Peace. I'm a walking liberty bell. Freedom ring through my stride. Freedom to be inside. And be a slave to my pride. And right away it is scream. Man, this love's so serene. I should probably shake it up just a little bit.